Hello, and welcome to another episode of Unboxing Weird Stuff. My name is Craig. And I'm Larry. And Larry is about to unbox this weird thing. Uh, let's check out this box. It's, it's pretty big in size, but very light in respect to. The shaking is peculiar. It's as if it feels like it occupies the whole space, but not necessarily, I don't know, it could be packing paper, but I don't think so. I think it feels as if it, something occupying the space, but it's definitely lighter. Okay, this is a double flapper. Double flapper. Oh, oh. oh. There's wow. something. That's something. Okay. Well, we immediately see the top portion of this, and there is some packing tape into it, but not packing tape, packing materials. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. What do we have here? This is incredible. That's really This is, it, this is deceiving. Really something. Because what we have here looks like official pirate cannonballs stacked in the cartoon pyramidal form that, they, that you would have, but it's... It's deceiving because, whoa, it's light. Hey, check that out. But, so if you set this down next to a pirate cannon, it would definitely be, uh, you know, a, a stack, official stack of cannonballs. I wonder if cannonballs really can actually stack this way. I mean, you, you yeah. see it in the cartoons and you see it, but, but, I mean, if you were really to task somebody to, I don't know, but well, it might depend on who you are. If you're Yosemite Sam, they're definitely going to oh, stack. Oh yeah, they're definitely uh, going to stack for sure. Way. Yeah, no, no, no doubts. Um, definitely of, uh, of of high quality manufacturing ability. Uh, the paint job is incredible on this. Let's hold this up so you might be able to see the careful attention to detail. Yeah, yeah. That's some well-constructed cannonballs. I, I, I have uh, one, one thought. Since, it, since it's so light, what you could do is um, if you have, if you have a, a, a circumstance where one of your kids keeps losing his mittens, you could, you could bore out this, this um, back half here such that you could make mittens, like winter mittens. For, for your kid when they go sleigh riding. Oh, right. Yeah. So yeah. like yeah, you'd need a you'd need a complimentary you'd need a, another uh, another set. Yeah, for, e yeah. Exactly. Yeah, so yeah, this would make a great this would make a this would make a nice this would make a nice set of mittens. Yeah, right. And if 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 you live somewhere where there's snow and you you're used to sleigh riding, um, you this would actually be a really good like a good steering mitt. Um, and 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 like there's there's a proper way to sleigh ride with a set of cannonball uh, steering mittens that you could use because this pointed edge it's got some it's got some like uh, some loft corner yeah yeah, yeah some yeah. loft to it yeah exactly yeah. so uh, uh, using a, a cannonball mittens for steering of a sleigh ride would be a very yeah. useful use for this well you know and another use I was thinking that would be nice for this is. Occasionally, you're on the road. You're on a road trip, and you're driving down the freeway, and you, and and you have to use the restroom really bad. So you you go to the next exit, the next off ramp, and you turn off, and you go to the first gas station you see, and you run in, and you say, "Can I use the restroom?" Well, sometimes what they'll do is they'll hand you a key, and the fop will be like a like a like oh. a, a, a fake yeah. flower. Or maybe a ruler or something. This actually would be an excellent keychain fop oh, at a gas station. Oh yeah. Like like if you went to a gas station and they handed you, they said, "Here, here's the keys to the bathroom. Go ahead." And you took that. You know, you used it. You went in and you used the bathroom. And you, there's no way you're going to steal these keys no. uh, because they're not going to get lost either. Yeah, because they're they're attached to a stack of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine. Yeah. Because they're attack they're attached to a stack of nine cannonballs. What you have in your hand is not just a set of bathroom keys. You have a set of nine cannonball bathroom keys. I'd advocate any I mean, 
Just your own personal use of keys. Oh, you yeah. You would never lose your you keys. You would never lose your keys. Unless you lived in a house where you had a lot of cannonballs yeah, everywhere. Yeah, that would Like be if a you problem. lived in one of those cannonball houses, mm -hmm. you know, for example. Yeah. Then there is a... So unless you live in a can, one of those cannonball houses, you know. Yeah. Then this then would be, this would be a great way to, 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 to not lose your keys. Thank you for joining us on yet another episode of Unboxing Weird Stuff, where Larry and I are unboxing something weird every single day. You take care, and we'll see you on the next one. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, like, and make plenty of comments. Oh, and if you have some weird stuff, send it to us. We'll unbox it.